For about every 1% OM you have, you have the capacity just in the soil of 20 pounds of N. So, yeah. So his point is the organic matter is going to mineralize. It's going to break down over time. And because it has nitrogen in it, it's going to release some nitrogen uh, available to be taken up by the plant. And I showed that down in South Florida. We have these really high organic matter soils in some locations in South Florida. And my graduate student down there did a work, did some work down there on Bermuda grass. And we found that the nitrogen you actually needed to apply on that specific soil was almost zero because there was such high organic matter in the soil already that was mineralizing. So that's, he's right about that. The, the organic matter, uh, I don't know what it's 1%, I don't know what his math was, but it's somewhere in that ballpark. So please, that, that is one reason, I guess, if you wanted to know organic matter, you have some sort of ballpark ideas to the nitrogen uh, supply of that soil. However, if you've done a calibration on your own soil, if you're applying nitrogen to your own soil, then you already account for the nitrogen that is being released. And what I mean by that, if you go out and you say, okay, I want to know how much nitrogen I need to actually result in acceptable turf or your or lawn care operators are the best. Because generally speaking, they're going to have a set program. And generally speaking, they're not interested in applying any more nitrogen than they have to, to keep everybody happy. So if you fine tune that over the years in your location, let's say you're in um, you know, North Carolina or wherever, you're in Indiana somewhere. And you've said, you know what, I've applied two pounds or two and a half pounds over the years. And I've slowly worked that down to about, say, a pound and a half because I just don't see much more benefit when I apply more and more. You are self-calibrating your location to nitrogen. You've self-calibrated that. So that self-calibration accounts for or already includes the nitrogen in those soils that is being released by the organic matter. Okay. That's what you should do. You should find that line, wherever that line is. And so you don't, my point is you don't have to worry about the organic matter and the nitrogen being released because you're accounting for it if you've calibrated the nitrogen rate necessary for your area. Okay. So be aware of that. That's, I guess that's one reason I guess you could maybe argue, I want to know what it is, but the organic matter, but okay, you know what it is. So what, if you're going to, if you're going to self-calibrate, I don't care what it is anyway, because I've already self-calibrated the nitrogen and it accounts for the nitrogen that's being released from the organic matter already.